Porphyria comprises at least eight metabolic disorders of the heme biosynthesis pathway. A subset, acute hepatic porphyria, or AHP, often presents as a sudden acute exacerbation, typically consisting of severe, diffuse abdominal pain, plus one or more additional neurovisceral symptoms, including the following. Nausea, vomiting, anxiety, confusion, limb weakness or pain, and many others. These acute exacerbations often require hospitalization and are potentially life-threatening, especially if misdiagnosed. But some patients also experience chronic debilitating symptoms, such as pain, nausea, anxiety, and tiredness that impact daily functioning. And they are at risk for progressive and possibly irreversible neuropathy and long-term disease complications that include hypertension, chronic kidney disease, or hepatocellular carcinoma. Each AHP is caused by a distinct defect in one of the eight enzymatic steps in the heme biosynthesis pathway in the liver. Acute exacerbations of AHP are precipitated by factors that induce upregulation of ALAS1, the key regulating enzyme at the start of the pathway in the liver. These precipitating factors include menstrual hormonal fluctuations, fasting or crash dieting, smoking, excessive alcohol consumption, infections, and numerous medications, especially ones that induce cytochrome P450 enzymes, which increases hepatic heme turnover. Any of these factors may hyperinduce ALAS1. ALAS1 upregulation, in addition to the specific downstream enzyme defect, causes overproduction and accumulation of the neurotoxic intermediates aminolevulinic acid, or ALA, and porphyrolinogen, or PBG. As excessive ALA and PBG accumulate, they enter the circulation and may cause injury to nerve cells across multiple organ systems. ALA, in particular, is thought to be neurotoxic and could be predictive of disease severity, accounting for characteristic symptoms such as neurovisceral pain and for potentially irreversible neuropathies. Elevated PBG may also be neurotoxic and is highly specific as a diagnostic marker for AHP. AHP is often misdiagnosed because the presentation resembles other more common diseases. But when AHP is suspected, simple spot urine tests for elevated ALA, PBG and porphyrins can establish the diagnosis in symptomatic patients. Note that urine porphyrins is a non-specific test and should not be used alone to diagnose AHP. In addition, genetic screening of families may identify pre-symptomatic carriers who can be counseled on their risk for acute and chronic symptoms and for potential long-term disease complications.